Ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, hello and welcome back to TIE Fighter Special Edition. I'm Computer, and last episode I didn't get uh, I didn't get blown up. Almost though, and I did fail two attempts at one of the missions, but everything went fine. We established a new base in the Pakuna system and everything was fine for the rest of well until Return of the Jedi, essentially. And now we shall start... Actually, yes, we shall start a conflict at Mylock 4. Battle pirates in the Outer Rim. Yeah. Yeah, it's... I, I honestly don't believe we'll get to play around with the TIE Advanced. We may. Although the, the whole bit about TIE Advance in a few missions ago, or actually an entire battle ago, now that I think about it, that might just have been a small little seed that they planted that won't get, uh, that won't sprout until several battles from now, maybe. So probably we'll get to fly a TIE Fighter, TIE Bomber, maybe a TIE Interceptor, and maybe a gunboat or two. So, yeah. Let's not keep our not let's not get our hopes up too far, right? Escort the Habin cargo convoy to a rendezvous with Admiral Zarin's modified frigate Seamus. Zarin? I haven't heard that name in a long time. All right, yes. Three groups of Thai fighters are assigned to see that these freighters arrive with their cargo intact. Hmm. The convoy is carrying newly developed starfighter technology that Admiral Zarin wishes to develop. Oh, right. That's, uh, he's part of the... the modified frigate Seamus will rendezvous with you mm, and Admiral for Zarin near Mylock 4. Escort the Habin cargo right. convoy. Uh, Zarin is part of... He plays a much bigger part of one of the expansions to TIE Fighter, I believe. Yeah, I think that's him. Uh, I might be wrong, but... I mean, he could also be the one in, like, uh, Rebel Assault 2, maybe. Admiral Zarin has we'll been find out. ...with overseeing TIE Starfighter development by Emperor Palpatine and Lord Vader. The R&D facility he commands has been completing the design of the production version of the TIE Advanced. This latest TIE Starfighter is derived from Lord Vader's specially modified TIE Fighter. Zarin scientists had hoped to perfect a hyperdrive engine that could be added to the TIE Advanced. However, they have not found a design that is reliable and small enough to be installed on a TIE craft. A breakthrough has been achieved by a group of scientists working for the Habin and the Narwhal. Admiral Zarin has negotiated to get demonstration versions of the new hyperdrive technology to evaluate. The Habin and Narwak are located in the Outer Rim territories on Mylock 4 and are currently not members of the Empire. Your mission is to escort the Habin convoy of four cargo ferries to a rendezvous with Zarin's ship. They really need uh, needed to work a little bit more on the timing of these like page changes. Actually, I'm going to see if I do Admiral this. Zarin has been entrusted with overseeing Be patient. Starfighter development by Emperor Palpatine and Lord Vader. The R&D facility he commands has been completing the design of the production version of the TIE Advanced. This latest TIE Starfighter is derived from Lord Vader's specially modified TIE Fighter. Okay, so I... Right, uh, I can click past when he... Yeah, uh, without stopping his uh, tirade. That's very good. You will be piloting a TIE Fighter designated Alpha 2. You will be the flight leader for the two wingmen in your group. Your craft will have eight concussion missiles installed. Hold on. You will be a wingman, but he said I would be the flight leader. Oh well, uh, I'm gonna trust him rather than the text for now. Also, uh, Lord Vader's TIE um, modified TIE fighter um, has both of its uh, guns uh, on the actual cockpit, just like a TIE fighter would, while the TIE advance has, has them on the tips like a TIE interceptor. Uh, I always find that a little curious. We do not expect trouble. 
However, the Habeen admit that their recent allies and co-developers of the new hyperspace technology, the Nawak, are not as eager to sell their advancements to the Empire. In fact, they are leaning towards doing business with the Rebellion. Therefore, the Nawak may try to intervene with Y-Wings and Z-95 headhunters to stop the convoy. Probably, maybe some shuttles as well. Maybe a transport here or there. Probably. Hmm. But it's nice that I get some missiles for my TIE fighter. Come on. Verify that the cargo ferries are carrying the cargo that matches their manifests. They should be carrying new starfighter technology. In this time of rebellion and terrorism, it pays to double check everything. I, I, mm. Shouldn't someone have done that already? Or maybe they're worried that the person that did do the checking was in on it, maybe? You know, I'm just the independent verification, so to speak. Also, yes, uh, double checking, no. No advanced st stuff. Um, yeah, let's go with missiles. I supposed to hmm how am I supposed to Third time's the charm. Hypertech and hypertech, good, yes. Um, let's see. Uh, expert tech, or whatever the exp EXP stands for. Now, here's a problem. Secondary goals completed. Yeah, 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 stop talking. You done? Very good. Right, Corellian Corvettes, two of them, they're a problem, but these Y-Wings, most of them are attacking my fighter friends, but there are going to be a few Y-Wings coming from around this direction later. And like, if you don't know that they're coming, they're going to destroy 50% of the entire convoy almost immediately with a bunch of torpedoes. So I'm gonna stay with these guys. And wait for... Three, five kilometers. Oh, wait, what? Right, good. Also, what are you? Yes, there you are. You guys need to die before you shoot all of your missiles. Oh, you're going that way? Okay, then I'm going that way too. I'm gonna put myself in the way. Let's hope his friends aren't going to shoot while I'm dealing with these guys. Yellow, good. Excellent work, Alpha 2. Alpha 2, mission critical. 
Thank you. What are we doing? 56%? Yeah, that's not great. Also, you guys. Oh, good. Thank you. Please try to do something about that guy, because I'm in a TIE fighter. Target destroyed. Target destroyed. Oh, you dealt with him. Okay, good. Now I need to double check. Don't know you. There we go. We have more yellows. That's not great. Um. Except they seem more interested in... How about yellow one? Yes. I think I've gotten... Oh, I don't have any more. That's... that's grand. I think I've sussed out their plan. One Y wing yet to fight the and do my oh, crap. Where did he go? Did I get it? Damn it! One more, and that ship dies. Now technically, I can still finish the mission by losing one of them. Only 50 have to survive, but I don't want to put myself in that kind of situation. If I had a gunboat, I wouldn't have to worry, because I could just ionize them, uh, or disable them, let's say, and no more yellows would spawn. Like, they really focused on Barak. You know what? I can't lose one. Because one is 50% of two. Damn it. Oh, crap. Let's see. Is it one? No. Where are you going? Okay. This is odd. You're going after Stimmer. And I don't have any missiles left. And I am wildly out of place, and that is... Yeah, this is not good. Come on, hit the thing. Thank you. You're friendly. Why are you so far, far out? I mean, tie interceptors would be nice around here. Also, yeah, you're after Stinger. Where are you for? You're after... I don't know what you're after, actually. Oh, just... Wait, Alpha 1, is it... Um... Oh, okay, so I shouldn't have trusted him. I should have trusted the actual text. Because I am the wingman, not the wing leader. Got it. I mean, it does make sense. Considering how many wingmen I get killed, so... That's... that's something. Let's 
Sorry. And 54, yeah, that's, that's, yeah. 56. Scarlet. It is soon. Oh, I'm really not at the best of places. I haven't decided yet, apparently. Oh! Well, I mean, yes. I actually do prefer you going after me. See if he shoots. He did indeed. Whoa! Not the smartest move. I mean, yeah. I wouldn't call it a good move to, like, rear into the path of your enemy. On the other hand, he has shields and I don't, so maybe for him it is a good move. And I, uh, That, that that clipped me nearly. And they used like dual linked shots. So if one hits, both hits generally. We think that's all of them, though. I tend to believe not. Let's... Oh, uh, not H. G. Corvette Charger 2 was inspected, but I didn't expect one, apparently. Oh, well. Yeah, go for, um, let the one that is completely uninjured do the docking first, not the one that is as fi that at 50% hull. That seems perfectly reasonable. Let's go with some, um, there we go. Yeah, my, uh, my fighter friends, please don't collide, thank you. My fighter friends are going back into the hangar, so I guess we're done, essentially. Good. Let's hope it doesn't come this way. Do that. Don't even hint at that. Good. Primary mission objectives completed. Excellent. Oh right, fifty percent. Right. That makes sense. Well, it doesn't take too long to wait for this to happen, so So you don't get a bonus goal for, excuse me, protecting all of them. Not sure if I'm, uh, actually, I'm going to wait for that ferry to go into hyperspace just to see if that does anything. That's one, that's two. 
That's nothing. Nice. I mean, as far as I mean, it's very conspicuous as far as tattoos go. Very easy to spot someone like that, you know. Fifty-two percent. Yeah, I can live with that now. Uh, yeah, I should have uh, inspected the other one as well. But it was a Coralian Corvette, and I wasn't a Tie Fighter. I wasn't going to. Never mind. Twelve. Half of them. So that's good. And I didn't destroy any of the Corvettes? Odd. And we lost the TIE Fighter. Probably one of my wingmen. The cargo ferries have successfully unloaded their cargo onto the Seamus. Zarin's research scientists are already hard at work conducting a preliminary analysis of the Habine technology. Right. All right, I've already seen that. You ensured that the Habeen convoy was carrying technology-related cargo. The Habeen technology could bring new advances to the Thai Starfighter line. I mean... I ensured it? No, 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 no. I verified it. Those words are very different and mean very different things. Uh, oh, well. Okay, no secondary objectives this time. Imperial patrols have located the secret base of Narwak ships carrying hyperdrive technology. The first objective is to stop the corvettes from escaping. Right. Then get the shuttles and the transport, hopefully before the parked starfighters are activated. You will huh? be among three groups of Thai bombers launched from the modified frigate Seamus. Oh, okay. That was done. Right. Or Imperial patrols have yes. located the secret base of Narwhal uh, ships carrying hyperdrive technology. What's that? Like a uh, space patrol craft, maybe? System patrol craft is actually the name. The first objective Those... is to stop the Corvettes from escaping. Or some kind of like cargo ferry, maybe? I should have double checked the last mission, but oh well. Nawak are incensed that the Habin are willing to sell their jointly developed technology to the Empire. They have defied all attempts at peaceful negotiation and have recently threatened to sell the hyperdrive technology to the Rebellion. The Rebels could use this technology to upgrade their existing fleet of hyperdrive-capable craft. We cannot let this technology be sold to the Rebels. Therefore, in this mission, we are launching an attack on the Nawak base where the technology is being stored. Destroy all cargo carrying vessels. Let no ship escape. Hmm. I mean, the rebels already have this kind of uh, small. Well, I mean, I guess they could make it even smaller than it already is. Because their uh, ships tend to be a little bit bigger than, like, fly TIE Fighters. A TIE bomber designated Alpha 2. Your craft will be armed with six proton torpedoes. You will have two others in your flight group. Fair. The Nawak are being supplied by the Rebels with older model starfighters like the Y-Wing. These craft will likely be used to defend their base. The base is also defended by Corvettes. Mm, yeah. Actually, the Corvettes are the bigger issue here. I really don't like them. Um, let's see. Do I actually want something bigger? No, I have two wingmen that can help me kill the Corvettes if I tell them to focus on them. Yeah, yeah, let's go with that. Except I'm not a wing leader. Maybe I can't tell the, uh, the squad leader to attack things? 
Hmm. Ow. Ow. Okay, yeah. Death by shuttle. Right, let's try that again, shall we? Torpedo, yes. At least now I know there's no real need to identify everything. Just... Yeah, just let out some stress, essentially. Enemy targets dead ahead. Uh, you guys go after that. Uh, not that. Um, I'm gonna deal with that guy. Switch to torpedoes and fire at will. Who's will? Hey, hey. Alpha two, get the corvettes first. They are trying to escape. Oh, they are. I mean, they could, I guess. What was that? Oh, you're someone coming into the battle. Got it. The shuttles are docking with the, the Y-Wings. That's how we get so many. Yeah, that's a Y-Wing on my butt. Oh, I'm way out of range. And he's way in range. I'm still kind of... So it doesn't actually hit me, thank you. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Don't got it, got it. Yeah, I, I'm still kind of bothered that these guys have, like, Y-Wing uh, blue. I mean, it does make sense that they got them from the Rebels, I guess. Also, power. More power? No, no, not less power. More. Thank you. Shuttle gone. Actually, let's see. Come on. Oh, wrong keyboard. Um, Corvette's gone. Good. We have Sunbird still needs to go. Come on. Five. This is Light Group Alpha using your target for attack. You know what? Use of the essence, and he probably shot a lot of. No, he got shot up instead. This is needed one. Target destroyed. Maybe one will be enough. Yeah, those are torpedoes you're trying to shoot. More, a lot of them. And the gunners destroyed. Got it. Alpha two, mission critical craft under attack. Actually, how hurt are you? Oh, not a lot. That's good then. Destroyed. 
Yellow, yellow, red. Let me hear Junker Workshop Repo. At least he changed direction. No, Max. The Nawab base is falling. It has been for a while. But sure, whatever you say. Sorry, sorry, my fault, or I mean, you flew straight into my line of fire, but still kind of my fault. Okay, fine. Oh, you're really... You really don't like this. Alpha 2, this is Alpha 1. Target destroyed. Good work, Alpha 2. Primary mission objectives completed. The Emperor will be pleased. Good looking attack, Alpha 2. The Narwhal vessels and supply caches have been destroyed. This was a very short mission. Real short mission. Seven minutes? No. Very short mission. Fifty six hundred, nice. Not a single secondary or bonus objective. That's kind of throwing me for a loop, actually. Uh, five, yeah. And yeah, of course. The Nawak base was eliminated, and the cargo containers and corvettes were destroyed. Further reconnaissance patrols are needed to determine if all the Nawak technology has been destroyed. I mean, probably. Oh, actually, no. Oh, well. Yeah, that was a weird mission. Like, the really, just a filler. The and the Narwhal for control of the hyperdrive technology continues. The Habin have requested our help. Their research facility is under Narwhal attack. A pair of old corvettes that have just unloaded cargo are their only defense. Also, some shuttles. The Habins need enough time to evacuate their base. Oh, they're just All rescue the rest craft. Got it. To board containers. The Nawak are using Y-Wing starfighters. It will be a slaughter if we do not stop them. The Interesting. The Corvette Phoenix will hyperjump there to intercept the attacking Y-Wings. The battle between the Habin and the Nawak for control of the hyper... So, tie bomber again. Against Y-Wings. Again. And no secondary missions. Again. 
how to stop an onslaught of Nahuatl Y-wings from destroying the Habin research outpost before it can be evacuated. Imperial intelligence has learned that in retaliation for our attack on their base, the Nahuatl are planning to launch a reprisal raid on the Habin Technology Research Center. Transport runner and two Imperial shuttles will rescue the base personnel. If the containers are destroyed before all three rescue craft have docked, you have failed in your mission. So no pressure. You will be flying a Thai bomber designated Alpha-1. Your craft will be armed with 16 concussion missiles for use in shooting the Nawak Raiders. You will have two wingmen in your flight group. You can expect to confront the remnant Y-wings of the Nawak fleet. Yeah, this... Uh... It seems like a stand-up fight, but... Games in general has just made me, like, assume the worst. Pretty much all the time, so... I think there will be some complications. I'm gonna assume that. Or presume, actually, because... Yeah. Yeah, you're... you're done. What are you doing now? Yeah, you're just leaving. Yeah, you're leaving. Okay. Give me advanced missiles, please. You're in range, and I really want to kill you. I shouldn't focus on this guy, I really shouldn't. No 
I'm not sure I entirely agree with that assessment of the situation. Turn around, that's good. He's not gray, he's blue, but fine. Order acknowledged, sir. Using your target for attack. Did we get him? Unknown tech. No okay. cargo. All right, this mission was. Pardon my swearing, but this mission was bullshit. Honestly, I can't. I cannot stress how badly designed this mission is. I mean, sure, you're meant to, like, this is a response to an attack, and you go in, and the attack is already has already begun. Yeah, but... Everything here is, like, has paper for shields. And... Like you saw, in the beginning of the mission, a Corvette dies within... Thank you. A corvette gets destroyed within a minute of you entering the battle. Well, I mean, not sure I agree. Cargo supplies. Oh, you just wanted to take her. And you, I shouldn't have bothered with you. Huh. No, yeah, this mission is very badly designed, because if it takes you, or rather takes me, six tries, I think, I, I, I basically lost count of how many times I needed to just run through this to just finish it. Uh, not finish it perfectly, I don't believe you can. Just finish it. Six tries? Yeah, no, that, that means it's probably a badly designed thing. Although I guess I can't really say that either, because I am kind of a bad pilot. But, you know, well, I guess the biggest issue I have is the hard cut from a real easy mission to this. Success. 45%. 100%. Okay, good. Well, I do appreciate that there were no secondary or secret objectives to worry about. But honestly... You have driven off the attack and secured the area. The Habin were able to successfully evacuate their research team and vital equipment. The Imperial Navy's effort here has gone a long way in finalizing a deal between the Habin and the Empire for their hyperdrive technology. Hmm. That's enough for now, yeah. Oh, and um, return to briefing. Yeah, no, um... I know X-Wing had a lot of also, like, nearly impossible missions. Uh, didn't realize TIE Fighter was quite that bad. And also, in, in the case of X-Wing, they actually fixed that in both the Collector's CD and the Special Edition, where they let you choose if you wanted to play new altered versions of those missions, or if you wanted to play the older nearly impossible missions. Wait, actually... Yes, I'm playing on medium, so, I mean, that... I don't think that has anything to do with it. Also, yeah, fourth circle. I forget how many circles there are, but um, just looking at this, there's probably another one and another one, so... six circles, maybe? 
or if they add more after that, I don't know. Transitions on, subtitles. I mean, we could use subtitles for some of the things. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Not a single. Huh. Doesn't look all that great, does it? Oh, yeah. You don't get a medal if there are no secondary or like secret objectives. That's kind of lonely. Oh, well. Um, yeah, uh, I'm a little bit annoyed at that last level uh, or mission. But like, it, it wasn't impossible. I can't really tell you what strategy to use. Just make sure to use up all of your missiles and make sure that you actually get a kill with them, obviously. Tell your uh, wingmen to attack one target while you attack another. Um, and try to break off their bombing runs as quickly as possible. And question marks profit, essentially. But anyway, I'm gonna go sleep <laughs> and edit this in the morning. So yeah, with that, ladies, gentlemen, and you beautiful in-betweens, I've been Computer. This has been TIE Fighter Special Edition. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.